Hey everyone, welcome back to Fingers Valley in Transport Fever 2. Right, last time got the line up to Centennial from, I extended the El Monte uh, line up into Centennial. And now um, I've punched a track through from Centennial to Columbia with a four and a half million dollar tunnel. And I'm going to bring that all the way on out to Sacramento. Now, in Sacramento, we're already using both terminals. So I need another terminal here. Um, now, the possibility is to run this all the way through to Wurzestur. Yeah. Um, and if I did that, then I'd need a... Uh, a, a pair of tracks for through running and you know what that might be the ultimate best plan so I'm going to actually do that so here uh, realistically I should probably shift these two tracks which terminate over here and allow the uh, the other track you know, I'm going to have to do some, some, uh, well, I could possibly share the, uh, this track. Hmm. Right. This is going to be the, uh, the complicated bit. So I need to get, you know what? Uh, I'm just going to, uh, start. One, two, passenger platform. Oh, ah, I see. You know what? If I take that out... Ah, yeah, that'll let me make the uh, the turn easier. Yeah, okay. And it won't interfere with this. Okay. Wait, no, I need uh, something else here. Um, misc. Need uh, one of those. Yeah. And maybe this. Um, are you going to just have that platform be shorter? Yeah, I'm going to do exactly that. Okay, then. Well, if it's through running trains, you know, stopping but through running, uh, then it it's not going to matter now, is it? Um, right. Okay. So what are you going to do? I'm going to crank this around like this. Oh, I see. Uh, can you actually crank it around? You, oh, you can. Um, is that what you really want to do? Yeah, I think it is. Okay, then. If that's what you really want to do, then go ahead and do it. Well, yeah, I was going to. Um, now what? Well, I think, uh, I think I, I need this to go up. Can I get it up enough to, no. Okay, so, uh, this is going to have to do level up to here. Yeah, yeah, okay, and so is that. Okay, do that, do that. Okay, so that needs to now go up. Go maximum up bubble. Okay. Uh, to about here. Then we come around to about... Ah! Uh, we get, uh,
Okay, come up to here, right? And then we can come down like that. Okay. And you are going to, which track are you? The inside one, okay. And then you, yeah, okay. And then you need to come around like this. Oh, dude, that works. I'm okay with that. Back that up like that. That's the inside track? Yeah, that's the inside track. Okay. So we'll build that. And then this needs to uh, get down to here. Okay. Now... Can we actually get the other track around? Yeah. Ah. This is acceptable. Okay. Right. So run this up a little bit. No. Snap it. Yeah. Okay. Do that. Then do this. Then do this. No. Back that up. Now, do this. Yeah, that's better. Good. Okay. So that will allow us to share this run of track out to where we have to peel off here to uh, run into this. Which, uh, if we do this, Okay. Oh, well, that's okay then. Um, then we need to bend around. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. Good. That's bending around. Now, we need to come off of here. Uh, we'll come up like this, and then we'll come across like that. Yeah, I think that works. Okay, now we have that. Back that up. Okay, good. Now, connect that. Yep, do this. Yep, good. That is tracks. Good, right. Now, uh, signaling. Yeah, we need signaling. Definitely. So we're going to need one here. One here. One here. Yeah. Uh, stick a couple here. And along here. Good. Now... I think we're going to need to make the signals a little denser along here. So let's do that. And we need this. Uh, okay. I'm not going to actually run the train through just yet. So I'm going to put one of these here and uh, put a signal here and probably here. Okay, come on. Uh, sometimes the orbital bombardment view doesn't give you a, a lot of uh, useful control. Now, I should be able to launch a train from here because of this shared bit of track. Yeah, okay. So if we come in here and we buy a vehicle, now we're going to want steam, of course, which um, this one does 64, that one does 50, that one does 50, that one does 60, that one does 55, 45. They all do a max of... Okay, well, the PV does 64, 
Okay, passenger. The Bolt does 60. Um, okay. This has 300 kilowatts. That has 284. Yeah. Yeah, we'll use that one. Okay. So, I'm going to want two of them on here, I think. Uh, new line. And we're going to go from... Let's pause it while I do this. Here to here, to here, and back. Yeah, okay. Uh, and that's gonna be the Columbia uh, to Sacker Intercity, right? Yeah, it is, okay. So we're going to come up here, we're going to, and this one, I definitely want to ride because I want to see how this goes. Um, right, okay. So we're heading for Centennial first, which is okay. That's, that's kind of what we need. Uh, we'll bear left. Okay, now we're on the shared track. Right. Uh, eventually, when I have faster passenger trains, I'll end up quad tracking this this stretch here. I'll have the uh, the high speed passenger trains on the left as we're facing here, and the freight trains will stay on the right. Uh, that's why I went with that uh, overpass back at uh, uh, Sacramento, was it? Uh, by building that overpass, it means the tracks are the trains are already on the correct side, and I don't have to try doing that later. And plus, it makes that track operation there more complicated, uh, which is always a win, isn't it? Um, okay, uh, we run through. Um, you see, I had planned to, uh, short, uh, short turn everything at, uh, um, Columbia there. This is our single track tunnel. And now we, uh, we're through the mountain and we can just tool along past the industry, which will probably go away before we, uh, finish anything. But the tracks will stay in their original path, and there will be the artifact of it, right? And, right, there's another industry. Our little punch through the uh, ridge. And look at that. There's our other track. And we had to wait for a train. Ooh. Well... That was unexpected. Right, and then we just blast on into uh, Centennial. Right. And we gotta wait for the same train again. Yeah, no, it's not a big deal. Uh, we'll probably pick up a couple passengers here because there's some on the platform. Um, more than a dozen. That's impressive. That guy's our other train, and uh, he's not going to pick anybody up. Right. Now we just need to go back over and find our tunnel again. I mean, it's going to be right where we left it, of course. Uh, I, I mean, where else would it be?
I mean, with all of these uh, cliffs and everything, you can't even see the edge of the map, and that's uh, that's pretty good for immersion, I would think. Right, back to our expensive tunnel. This will, of course, enforce a little bit of spacing on uh, trains. Uh, not that much, really, given the length of the line, but it will enforce some. And we're going to stop here and pick up a couple, drop off a couple. And now we head on for Sacramento, right. And this is, of course, the shared track. Well, not this bit. The bit coming up. Yeah, ultimately, I'll just punch the uh, punch the high speed track right through there, and uh, I will be able to you know, have less conflict points. Because the uh, freight trains will top out at about 120, 150 uh, at the maximum tech level. But the passenger trains can hit 200 plus, uh, 250, uh, I think, uh, on longer runs. And this run is long enough that they could potentially do that. Okay, and now we uh, split off for the overpass here. We up we go. And around we go. Right. Oh, I do like that track bending out going that way. Okay. Well, this is uh, definitely good. Uh, okay. Now, uh, this run will be pretty straightforward. Uh, it'll be run through the gap here, come across the uh, river, uh, run into this track, and then into uh, the W place. Yeah. Uh, okay, now, we definitely need to add here uh, some uh, trammage. Okay, so how are we going to add the trammage? Well, we're going to go in here. Uh, buildings, yes. Uh, we're going to need here. Um... Hmm. That's in an inconvenient place. Um, right, okay, let's um, kill that. Uh, put that. What was on this side? Yeah. Put that here. Yeah. Okay. Now I can put this here and here. Right. Yep. And then we can have one of these here and here and here and here. Right. Close that. Now, how does that do for... Okay, that gets us uh, the coverage that we need initially. Okay. So, now I need a one... No, I need a one of these. Yeah. Okay. So, you're going to put it here, are you? Yeah, I'm going to put it there. Uh, okay. Well, you can definitely do that. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm doing it. Right, okay, you didn't have to answer that. No, I know. Okay, we got this, and we've got this. Yep, okay. Now we go in here, we're going to buy, we're going to get this guy... Uh, one, two, three. 
uh, you can go here, 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 and here. And this is going to be Columbia Crosstown. Um, what did I call? Yeah, I use Clumb. Okay. Uh, no, we go in here. New line. And this is going to be Clumb Longitudinal. Right. Okay. That'll get uh, more passengers getting to and from the station there. Uh, I think we probably need something here in Sacker as well. Uh, might need it in two, might need two cross towns ultimately. Um, right. Uh, well, uh, while I'm poking about in here, I'm going to connect that. Dude, that's wild. Uh, but now take it out and do it again, but better. Okay. This that's what you mean by better? Yeah, it is. Uh now it's straight. Oh, I see. It's straight. That's what I said. It's straight. Um Okay, configure this uh, passenger building. Can you can you fit one here? Yeah, you can. Okay. Now I can see that where these are right. So I'm going to grab a road, center it there, and center it there. Uh-huh. Do that. Why'd you do that? So I can do this. Oh. So you can get more uh, station coverage there. Yeah, exactly. Um, good. Right. This is going to be the longitudinal. And this is going to be the cross town, I think. Yeah, and there'll be a cross town here. Yeah, ultimately. Right, okay. Out of curiosity, can I fit platform? I can actually lengthen the platforms here. I'm going to do that. Okay. Okay. Uh, no, we go tracks. Uh, you come up to there. You come up to there. You come up to there. Yeah, okay. And we configure this passenger building here. Take that one out. Right, okay. Um, no, I need a, another. I need to misc it and put one of those. Uh, I think there and there. You know what? Let's put an underpass there too. Yeah. Underpasses are us. Okay. Okay, that gets a uh, nice and uh, offset uh, station, but I think it works. Yeah, it'll work. Uh, it, it's, it's all good. Um, yeah, that will definitely be all good as I put it. Ah, okay, I can uh, do this to get it... Uh, Yeah. 
you know, this obsession with building roads is going to bankrupt you. I'm like, no, no, it probably isn't. Yeah, you're probably right. It probably isn't. Um, let's bring a road across. No, it was this one. Uh, do that. Okay, good. All of that so that you can uh, put some trams in, right? Yeah, pretty much. Buildings. Yeah. Unpause it. Yeah, okay. So we're going to put here and here. Yeah. And here. Both ways. And here. Yeah, that seems appropriate. Okay. And here, here, here. Yeah. So here, 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 there, and there. Yeah, that's acceptable. Okay. Well, now you need one of these. Yeah, I kind of do. Uh, where am I putting it? You're going to put it over here. Okay. Well, I'll definitely put it there then. Okay. So you built that. Now you need this. Yep. Uh, yeah, that uh, that will work. Okay, good. Now we grab uh, another half dozen of these. Not 61. Okay. New line. Fun here, 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 here. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So that's the Sacker Cross Town. Yes, it is. Right. Okay. Now you go in here. New line. And this is the Sacker Longitudinal. Right. Okay, that will get more passengers for Sacramento. Um, okay, then when the time comes, we can build the uh, rest of the uh, line out to the W place. Right. But I think that is probably... That's probably all, to, all, all we're going to do this time. Let's take a look here. Uh, we're headed for 271 in Sacramento. El Monte is headed for, is at 260. Columbia is heading for 159 apparently. Um, right. Okay. And Centennial headed for 204. Uh, okay. Be interesting to see how this develops. Uh, yeah. Okay, so far so good. Now, let's uh, just check in over here and uh, repay uh, the loan. Yep. Okay. Um, yeah, so it looks like we, uh, we're running a couple of profitable term uh, or periods, followed by a loss, followed by a couple profitable ones, followed by a loss. We're a couple million up this, uh, this period with uh, no expensive investments. Um, okay. Hmm. Right. Well, uh, 
let's just see. Uh, okay, so 581 to 781. Um, okay, so that should go to about the end of July. Right? Hmm. We're at July 15th uh, at 1881. Okay. Um, yeah, next uh, project is going to have to be another freight project. And then uh, a, a cargo project. And then uh, uh, from there, we'll have... Uh, uh, Hopefully, we'll be getting to the point where we have where, where where the money printer is keeping up with uh, spending, right? Okay, so okay, we had one point seven that period. Okay, well, okay. That's uh, that's working out fine. Uh, haven't gone bankrupt yet. Uh, this is on hard money, uh, as I recall. Not very hard. Uh, I tried very hard, and uh, I couldn't make it. I couldn't make it work. Um, I'm pretty sure that I I had bad bad deals on uh, industries but i couldn't make it work with a low in, in industry density and low town density from the start and that just because uh, i just couldn't find that the uh, locations where i could do uh lines that were full both ways right uh, and without being able to do that uh, i was just eh, i was slipping just ever so slightly further in the hole every tick uh, just on running costs, on overhead costs, right? Oh, the W place would probably stand uh, some more uh, TLC at some point as well. How's it doing, actually? 300. Okay. I do like this thing it's got going along the riverfront here. Um, yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. probably connect these two roads here otherwise it's going to do something dumb um yeah i'll do that connection because it will do something dumb otherwise uh right okay well anyway uh this is uh long enough for this episode so uh, i'm gonna call it uh call it an episode here uh I'm going to keep at this map for a bit yet. Um, not sure what the next project's going to be. I'm pretty sure it'll be freight, cargo, whatever. Uh, but we'll see. I might wind the time forward a little bit before, uh, before then. But anyway, uh, if you do want to support the channel for whatever reason, uh, I do have a Patreon. The link is in the doobly-doo. And you can uh, go ahead and uh, you know pledge whatever you want uh, if you want. If you don't, that's fine too. Uh, if, if you don't do Patreon, then don't do Patreon. It's entirely up to you. Uh, it's just there uh, in case you want to support the channel. Uh, there's no especially brilliant perk or any official perk at all. Uh, so, you know, you can go ahead and join or not as you see fit. Yeah, you know, entirely up to you. I said that. Right. So end the video then. Okay, good. Video over. Well, no. Uh, that's all for now. See you back next time.